Happy Team Tuesday, Maidens. I wanted to talk a little bit about what goes into hostess packets as well as what I send for sample requests. I've gotten a lot of questions about that over the past few days. So let's get the ball rolling. The first thing that I will put into my hostess packets is our catalog. So I send one catalog as well as two of the paper um, order forms because in this day and age, there's always someone who doesn't want to sign up and log into the internet. Um, some people don't like putting their credit cards out there, and that's fine too. So always put a catalog as well as two paper order forms. The next thing that goes into my hostess packet is a host join brochure. The host join brochures are fantastic. They are very inexpensive and they have all of the information that our hostesses as well as potential um, team members could need. So this is kind of a one-stop shop for everything um, Jamberry. So this goes out with everything that I send, whether it's a sample request, whether it's a hostess packet, whether it's a sample that I give to somebody in the checkout line at the grocery store. I want to get these out to as many people as humanly possible. So that goes into my hostess packet as well. The next thing that I put in my packet is a half sheet of wraps. Now, this being said, I was not able to do this for my hostesses until fairly recently. So I know most of you guys are new, and I recommend what I used to do is I would send my hostess a full sheet of accent nails. Um, but now, like I said, I am able to send them a full half sheet. So if you can, definitely get them a half sheet because we want them to have that experience. We want these on their fingers. We want them talking to anyone and everyone they come in contact with about them. We need to get jams on their hands before their party. So again, if you can, give them a half sheet of wraps. If you can't, that's fine but at least give them a full sheet of accent nails. The next thing that goes into my hostess packet, um, these we get in our promotion and marketing section on our workstation, is the tearaway application instructions. These are fantastic. Um, the price point is, is fairly cheap. It's either $250 or $350, I think it might be $350 um, per pack of these, and these are well, well, well worth it. So I give one to four of these, in that hostess packet as well. The next thing that you want to make sure that you have in your packets are four of our cards, our seven day sample challenge cards, because these your hostess can keep in her purse, in her bag, you know, at her desk at work, wherever she's at, she can have them with her at all times to give away saying, you know, hey, I'm having a Jamberry nails party. Why don't you try them out? I have some samples right here. Let me know what you think. What I have done, now Carrie Fowler um, was awesome enough, she had uploaded um, the front of these cards as well as a separate back for these cards, which is fantastic. Um, but I actually went to discountrubberstamps.com and I had this made with the QR code. So on the back, you know, it gives them my website and they can scan for application instructions. It's just up to you what you'd like to do and what your budget allows. So again, I give four of these. Last but not least, I give them my business cards. I give anywhere for, from two to four because you want your hostess to be able to have one as well as anyone that she comes into contact with. So I always make sure that I have business cards in there. Now, what I feel sets me apart from other Jamberry consultants um, is not only my attention to detail, but I think that I go above and beyond with my customer service, and I'll talk to you a little bit about that um, down the road in another Team Tuesday training. But what I would strongly encourage you being on my team to do to uphold my tradition, because we are better and we want people to do business with us, is show them that you care. So I send a handwritten note, probably all of you at some point in time so far has gotten a handwritten note from me. Now I put this in with my hostess, 
packet, obviously. Thank you for hosting a Jamberry party. These are on the Jamberry print shop. You get 25 of them for $2.50. Again, a little goes a very long way. And then on the back, this is where in the blank space that I will write a note to my hostess thanking her for hosting the party and also explaining to her what else is in her hostess packet. So you can do one of two things. I've decided to, I used to send these out in a, with, as a postcard, just with a postcard stamp, but now I've just started to include to save on postage that I just write the note and I put everything um, in my envelope. Now, a lot of people also ask what size envelopes fit our catalogs. So it is actually, this it's six and a half by nine and a half. Um, these envelopes fit our catalogs perfectly. You can fit your catalog, your host join, anything and everything you need in them. These are just the ones I think I got them at Office Max. They're really inexpensive. Um, I don't get the clasp. I just kind of um, you know seal it down and put a piece of tape on it as well. And that is what I send in my excuse me in my hostess packs. Now what I send in my Sample packs are somewhat similar for samples. I do it a little bit differently though. I chose to give them the host join brochure, give them the, the instructions, as well as their seven day sample challenge card, but I attach it up here. I actually staple it because what I have found is this card is the exact same size as a business card and I think people don't pay attention and sometimes they accidentally throw it away. So with everything being attached, they have everything and they pull it right out. Everything is right here so they're gonna see exactly what it is that they need and all the information that they have. The only thing I don't do is staple my business card. But all of this goes into an envelope just a regular office envelope, standard envelope, as some of you guys have gotten from me before, put everything in here, seal it, and call it a day. So the last thing that I want to touch base with you on that I found um, that I think is so worth the price, um, again, a little goes a long way, is I found this company called The Booster. Um, you can go online and it's called it's thebooster.com and they make these amazing stickers. They are so much fun. And to me, this kind of gives, well, it would help if I put it the right way, right? Yeah. So this actually gives you um, a little way of kind of a tiny subliminal message for your girls that are trying the product for the first time, whether it's a sample or if it's your hostess. So I love to seal my envelopes with a sticker. So these, again, it's the booster.com. Some of them are 99 cents a sheet. I think the most I've seen is like $2 a sheet. Um, but they're just so much fun. Like this one says, you know, have fun making money, ask me how. Another one says, let's see, so this one is, what would you do with an extra $1,000? Ask me how. Then this one is my absolute favorite. I love it. I want to get more sheets of them. It says, where would you do and make money to? And again, it's just, you know, kind of a simple, quick way to get their minds thinking about um, possibly joining your team. So those are the tips that I have um, and that I've been using, and it seems to work really well for me. So again, feel free to modify, you know, to your budget and to your market and what you see fit. But um, that's what I send. So, again, happy Tuesday, ladies, and I will talk to you next week. Bye-bye.